welcome back to my channel in today's video i am going to be talking about as by the title you already know it's going to be about niacinamide and if you are a skincare lover you already have heard about this ingredient i guess like a million times because um every other skincare brand out there is coming up with products that has this ingredient in it so i'm going to be mostly uh reviewing the ordinary niacinamide i'm going to be talking a little bit more about niacinamide how it works what it does its benefits it does it have any side effects if you aren't a subscriber please hit that subscribe button down below and click on the notification bell, bell as well so that you'll get notified and i'll pop up in your screens um from time to time okay so i have actually my notes written down here so that i just don't get off track and i just like give you guys a gist of everything that i know that's you know that's this, just the makeup like the skincare geek in me uh anyway so the niacinamide is actually a form of vitamin b3 and uh, what it does for our skin is and not in a scientific term i'm not going to use any scientific term out here so what it essentially does it, it keeps the skin healthy so the benefits of niacinamide is it it helps in uh tighten up your pores it reduces the actually the size of your pores it helps in skin brightening it helps to reduce the texture of your skin the small bumps that you get like we have the uneven skin texture it helps to even out your skin tone and it also helps the sebum production so that it doesn't uh, produce excess oil it's very good for oily skin it helps for anti-aging reducing of dark spots and pigmentation so those are all the benefits of niacinamide uh, so when it comes to skincare ingredients niacinamide is actually one of the least uh, irritating ingredients out there and i will show you a video of how my skin looks right now just because i have makeup on and you can see my uh, natural skin so i'll definitely insert a clip of how my skin looks so coming on to the ordinary niacinamide serum it comes in this kind of packaging i know you can see it nicely here but i will show insert a clip and it comes in a glass bottle so it's uh, the packaging is quite simple and the price of this is i believe it was like i got this for 4 euro um from curl beauty i'll leave the link down below and if you are purchasing first time from curl beauty you will get a uh, free shipping on your products so i got this for rupees 400 and this is how the bottle looks like it's quite big as you can see compared to my hand it's 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 a big bottle so the consistency of this is a uh, gel like but it's water based so it's not oily or anything like that and it spreads very very evenly on your skin and um also it absorbs in your skin within seconds like you have to be really fast while uh, applying this and while applying it all over your face just because it will get absorbed in your skin within like 2 seconds or 3 seconds that is how the texture of the product feels like i've seen a lot of reviews about the ordinary uh, niacinamide and mostly oily people say it's like a boon for their skin just because it helps in the balancing the sebum production and helps to keep your um, uh, oils really balanced out so when it comes to dry skin i have i have like really dry skin um i was like a little bit skeptical uh but i still purchased it cuz i have been seeing it this ingredient everywhere and i just wanted to test it out so as for my review i have been using this for more than a uh, month now and um as for my review the first time i used it it was amazing okay the texture i have i have a lit i don't have a lot of texture but i did have a little bit of texture around this area Uh, I also have a breakout here. Um, I don't know. I, every time I tend to film a skincare video, like some pimple pops out. I have no idea why. But anyway, I had a little bit of texture here. And the first time I used this serum, I used to use this. I used this at night, and I just used this. And uh, the next morning, my texture was really gone. Like. 
like I had a really smooth skin and it worked overnight. I wasn't expecting it to work overnight because I, I feel like no, no skincare does that. Like I at least give one or two weeks for a skincare to work properly. So I wasn't expecting overnight results at all. I don't have a lot of texture now anymore at all. Like I hardly have texture. Um, just looking at the skin, I have a little bit of texture here. I, I don't know if you can see, but a little bit like the slightest amount if you come really close to my skin then you can see I have a little bit of texture here around here and um, there is like this pimple and yeah that's about it like my skin looks pretty good so the next uh, thing I noticed about niacinamide is that if you have a pimple it will not come through like uh, it will just stay underneath the skin and it will go away in one or two days. Like it doesn't come out. I had a pimple here like two days ago here in this area. I can still feel it. it it's like a tiny bump now, but it never came through. Like I, I, I didn't have to pop it out or anything like that. It, it just was underneath the surface of my skin and it just went away like that. So that is one of the major thing I noticed about the niacinamide is that it doesn't let your pimple come through in like through the skin. I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, I hope you guys understand it. So coming on to my dry skin, I think it really helped in the hydration part. Like I don't want to say that whenever you apply this, you're going to look hydrated or anything like that. But uh, what, what I mean is that it uh, helps in the ceramide production. So it kind of helps your skin to stay plump. It kind of helps to your skin to stay hydrated. It doesn't uh, result in water loss. It, it kind of retains the water and the hydration in your skin. So it's very, very helpful for dry skin as well. And for bright, brightening of skin, my, I have been using vitamin C as well. So I can just say that this one alone did brighten up my skin or brighten up my dark spots because I have been using the vitamin C as well. So along with vitamin C and niacinamide, I think my dark spots have been reduced to a very good extent. So now, um, how do I incorporate it in my skincare? I just take two drops of niacinamide onto my palms and I just like tap it across my skin. And I don't use this in the morning time. You can mix this with moisturizer. Since I use a vitamin C in the morning, I don't like to use niacinamide in the morning just because I use the ordinary vitamin C. And in the, and in the ordinary website, they say that not to use the order vitamin C and niacinamide together. So in the morning, I use the vitamin C and at night, I use the niacinamide. And if you don't use vitamin C, especially the ordinary one, what you can do is you can use the niacinamide in the morning as well with your morning moisturizer. And it, this one layers really well with any skincare product. It layers good with oils, it layers good with moisturizers, anything, it's, it's amazing. Do I recommend uh, the ordinary niacinamide serum and does it work? I think it definitely works. I, so do I really recommend only this one or any other niacinamide serum? I think you can go for any other serum, any other niacinamide serum. I'm mainly focusing on the ingredient here more than the product. I feel like this product is amazing because the niacinamide here is actually 10% which is very potent and the other serums that you get in the market is uh, may sometimes contain niacinamide but in a lesser percentage so it's up to you actually where you want to invest your money on and this one is very very inexpensive so that's why I did spend uh, my money on the ordinary and as I have been loving all the ordinary products I just thought of purchasing this one so I definitely think that niacinamide is an ingredient. I think everyone should incorporate it on their in their skincare routine. Maybe it in moisturizers or serums or you know any other skincare product like cleansers as well. So when it comes to skincare, I'm definitely not a specialist. I am just a normal regular consumer. I love talking about skincare. I am obsessed with skincare lately. So hopefully you guys like the video and um, 
thank you so much for subscribing and thank you so much for watching i love you all so much i'll see you in my next video bye bye